Hi there, Jody Bentley here, actor, producer, and career coach. And look, I know that the industry isn't back to what it was. I know it's much slower than what I want it to be right now. And I wanted to share with you 10 things you can do right now in times when it feels slow or slowish to position yourself as an actor who is moving and shaking. So number one, I invite you to add production stills to your IMDb page. A lot of times, especially with new clients that I meet, I find that a lot of actors just have their headshots there. But add your production stills, add BTS photos, add something that shows me that you are working. I wanna position you as a working actor. Second thing to do, consistent social media presence. Create and craft a consistent social media presence that is authentically you, that is vulnerable, that shows me who you are as a person, your point of view, and as an actor. Let me learn about you through social media. Tell a story of who you are. Show me that you are out there moving and shaking and doing things, and social media is a great platform to do that. Third thing you can do, add a news section on your website and update it. For the love of God, please update it. It is the worst to go on an actor's news page and see something from two years ago. But add something there. Let me know what you're up to. Let me know about that Zoom reading or that short film that was released that just came out over this time period. Let me know what's going on. Let me know that you're creating stuff, right? So adding that news to your website and updating it is key. Fourth thing you can do. Create a self-tape or quarantine reel. I've been supporting a lot of my clients in doing this right now because a lot of people are, are actually creating, and I'm sure you are as well, some really great self-tapes right now. Uh, characters doing monologues with these new characters that they're developing. Put together a quarantine reel or your COVID-19 reel, whatever you want to call it, um, and let people know what you've been doing. I mean, casting directors want to know that you have a nice self-tape set up. So if you're doing all this stuff in your self-tape set up, let us see it. It is perfectly viable now to have that be a, a solid marketing tool for you. So create a self-tape or a quarantine reel. Fifth thing you can do. Add a production photo on your home page instead of a headshot, or maybe in addition to your headshot. Again, let's position you as someone who is working. Show me what your face looks like on camera or on stage, right? Let me see that as opposed to just the headshot. There's a bunch of places on your website to put the headshot. Maybe have that home page be a production still, or again, something from you on stage, or some reviews, something that shows industry agreement and positions you as someone who is working. Sixth thing you can do to be moving and shaking as an actor right now, get involved with online readings of plays and screenplays. Keep your skill set up, connect with new people, build relationships, practice in this medium. So doing readings over Zoom um, can be a really great way, again, to keep your skill set up and continually build relationships with people in this industry as well. Seventh thing you can do. Well, if you're not on LinkedIn, get on LinkedIn. Uh, but when you are on LinkedIn, write recommendations for directors you've worked with, actors you've worked with, producers you've worked with. There's a built-in system in LinkedIn where you can write recommendations for people. It's a great tool to use. So I really invite you to do that because when you write a recommendation for someone, they will most likely write one back for you. And if they don't, then you can just reach out and ask them. So it's a great way, again, to reconnect with um, other people you've worked with in the past and to get industry uh, validation of your talent that you can share in different aspects as well. Eighth thing you can do, stay on top of industry trends, share articles, stay in the know. So when new things come out in Variety, Hollywood Reporter, Deadline, we got to stay on top of this stuff right now because things are changing all the time. So stay on top of that and share that information as someone who is in the industry and knows what they're talking about and is sharing information. The ninth thing, ninth thing you can do uh, to position yourself as an actor who's moving and shaking, get in an acting class or create like a cold reading group over Zoom with some fellow actors, right? 
But why do I say this? And, and I kind of mentioned it with the readings, but practice over Zoom. This is now your callback scenario. This, you get to learn to act in this little box, in this new space. So get in an acting class to practice or get an online group with your friends to practice. It is so important to be ready. And if you haven't acted in this medium before, it takes a little bit to get used to. I've been in an acting class now for three months over Zoom, and it's really helped. So I really invite you to do the same for yourself. And the 10th thing to do uh, to position yourself as that actor who's moving and shaking is create, 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 create content, write a script, um, create uh, uh, videos like I'm doing right now, create something, create self tapes, create characters, just create for yourself and then to share with the world. But it's important to keep your creative juices going because when we are fully back up and functional, it will be busy, right? And you got to keep these creative skills going. Or this is the time when you, if you've ever said, I've always wanted to write this screenplay or this short film, create it, do it now. You are an artist and you get to create. And again, that positions you as someone who is moving and shaking, even when times feel slow or slowish. So here are my top 10 tips to do just that. Um, start with one or two or three of them. Um, add them into your routine as an actor and really start to um, put out there who you are, what you do and show everyone what you are doing right? It's up to us to create our own buzz. So follow these 10 uh, things to do, and I will see you uh, in my Facebook group. The links are below. Okay, bye.